Oh, again we cross paths. I believe I said my name was Rena when last we met. It pleaseth me to see Torrent hale and hearty, but tarnished. What business hast thou here? I have no memory of inking thee an invitation. No reason in particular thou claimest. Intriguing. Then mayhaps fate hath steered thee to this reunion. Hmm. Wilt thou enter into my service? I am the witch Rani. I stole death long ago, and search now for the dark path, that I might one day upend the whole of it, and rid the world of all that came before. Well, has that roused thy interest? I see. A choice well made. Thou art a rare sword. Not many would have accepted the offer, but I require as much of those under my command. I anticipate good work from thee. Good. Then I ask we proceed with haste. There is, in my service, a half-woven warrior by the name of Blythe. I would have thee join him in searching for the hidden treasure of Nokron, the Eternal City. I have called for Blythe to greet thee below. Take from him the particulars. Ah, and there wilt thou find E.G., my war counselor, and Salavis, preceptor in the sorcerous arts also. Heed not their peculiarities. Feel secure in gaining from them. What advantage thou canst. I am sure the others will be doing just the same. Speak with the three who await thee below. Thou needs... Everything. Again, I am Eiji, the Karian royal family's dedicated blacksmith and Lady Rani's war counselor. I am told that you are searching for Nokron with Blythe. I will give you whatever guidance I can and pray for your success. Let us give all that we can of ourselves, together, for Lady Rani. Ah. I heard about you. Good to finally meet. Name's Blythe. Sworn sword to Mistress Rani. Glad to have you aboard. Well, getting right to business. I'm situated in Limgrave right now. The eternal city of Nokron lies somewhere at the bottom of this land. I'm planning to go below through the well in the mistwood. See if I can't find the road to Nokron from there. I'm going below through the well in the mistwood. I see. You must be Rani's new hireling. Yes. Yes, I've heard all about you. I am Salavis, preceptor in the sorcerous arts. I don't know what it is the mistress sees in a provincial tarnished like you, but since we have the misfortune of serving the same lady, I ask that you kindly try not to drag us all down with you. I reside in another... I reside in...
Allow me to forewarn thee. I shall soon enter my slumber, and it will be some time before I wake. This doll's body is not without its hindrances. Still, I have high hopes for thee. I look forward to the good news when I arise. I shall soon enter my slumber. my word. Did you not realize I was merely being polite? Oh, you provincials never cease to amaze. Uh, I suppose you're here now. Perhaps I'll give you something to do. I'd like you to find a woman called Nefeli to administer a potion. Even you can do that much, can't you? Good, good. Now I shall hand over the potion in question. Find Nefeli and ensure she drinks it. I expect glad tidings, and soon. Greetings, my fellow. How can I help? Blythe is Lady Rani's stepbrother. Rani's mother, Queen Renala, approved of him, and they played like siblings from childhood. They were always happy to have me tag along as well. When Lady Rani renounced her flesh and chose the dark path of the Empyrean, Blythe and I swore allegiance as vassals, but none of us will ever forget our earliest days together. Promise to look after Blythe for me, will you? The man is honest to a fault. But fortunately, now he has you. I take it you've heard of the eternal city of Noxtella. Well, it has a twin known as Nokron, the other eternal city. After years of expeditions, we've determined the location of Nokron by going underground through the well in the mistwood of Limgrave. You can see Nokron up above, only we failed to find a path leading to the city. Blythe's made a good go of it, but I'm afraid this has him quite stumped. To be honest, I'm not sure where to go from here. 